Y'all know what it is and who it is. Fight night decks for four, four, four corners boxing. And let me talk my shit real quick. Like the maniac would say, let's talk about it. Let's talk about Shakur Stevenson performance last week. Yes, he picked up his 22nd victory. He has 10 knockouts. He's a three division champion. And he successfully defended his WBC lightweight championship. Yes, he did. But he also disappointed yet again. He also had people walking out of the arena. He also had his own fan base sleeping ringside. He also is getting criticism, as he does always, because he runs his mouth. And on Twitter and social media, boy, is that man pound for pound. And he got that pop. And he got that urgency and that dog in him. But in the ring, there's no dog. There's no urgency. There's no, let me show the people that at least I'm going for it. And bing, 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 bing. You know what I'm saying? Put the beats on Artem. No, man, he got tagged up a little something, but he dominated the fight, and yes, he did win. This was his last fight on his top rank contract, so he's talking shit about top rank. Y'all couldn't promote me right. They've done everything in their power, put him up and down the East Coast, Newark, AC, MSG. They took him out to Cali. They took him out to Vegas. They've done everything in their power. He's a three-division champion. Oscar Valdez is probably the best fighter on his resume, from what I'm opinion, but for my opinion, excuse me. But you're going to hear more about this Wednesday night, 15 rounds of boxing, tune in. Shakur Stevenson, what's going to happen? What you're going to do, brother, when you got the tank in front of you?